हेलो चिल्ड्रन वेलकम बैक फॉर ऑनलाइन स्टडीज टुडे चिल्ड्रन व्हाट वी आर गोइंग टू लर्न टुडे वी आर गोइंग टू लर्न लेसन नंबर एट आवर नीड फॉर वाटर सो चिल्ड्रन व्हाई वी नीड वाटर दैट वी आर गोइंग टू सी इन दिस लेसन सो लेट्स स्टार्ट द लेसन चिल्ड्रन ओपन पेज नंबर फोर्टी सिक्स now see can you tell this happens doesn't it now children what happens that we are going to see here sometimes tears flow from our eyes now children when mummy or teacher scold you at that time you start crying and tears flow from your eyes our mouth waters when we see a tamarind pot now children when mummy makes a delicious dishes for you at that time our mouth waters means children when mummy makes some delicious dishes in a house at that time our mouth वॉटर्स मीन्स मुँह में पानी आना आवर नोज रन्स वेन वी हैव अ कोल्ड नाउ चिल्ड्रन वेन वी हैव अ कोल्ड वी स्नीज आवर नोज गेट्स ब्लॉक वी हैव प्रॉब्लम इन ब्रीदिंग एंड आवर नोज स्टार्टेड रनिंग वॉट डज दिस टेल्स अस नाउ चिल्ड्रन what does it tells us now when we get a cut it bleeds suppose children i or you cutting an apple and your finger or my finger gets cut what will happen at that time our finger start bleeding so what does this tells us now see tears saliva water running from the nose and blood are present in our body now children these all things are present in our body they are substances that flows they contain water means these are the substances that flows in our body and they contained water try this do this under adult supervision take a small piece of cucumber now children you have you are going to try this now take a small piece of cucumber grate it squeeze it hard and take a slice of lemon Squeeze it hard too. What do you see? Juice flows out of the grated cucumber and the lemon slice. What does it tells us? There is water in a cucumber and a lemon. So children, you are going to try this experiment in a supervision of your mother. So. you have to do this experiment at home now next why do we feel thirsty we need water if our body has to function properly so children why do we need water because our body has to function properly water keeps our body thin water helps to digest our food unwanted substances leave our body through urine we must have enough water in our body at all times when there is a lack of water in our body we get thirsty now children see, water is a basic need of all living things when we run for a long time or we walk for a long time after coming back 
we feel thirsty like us other living things to need water to live our life why we need water children to live our life now next page page number 47 now children on page number 47 there is a picture a public source of water now see that picture carefully and can you tell me which animals are drinking water at the river bank so children you are going to tell me that which animals are drinking water at the river bank okay i will tell you goats are drinking on the river bank who is playing in the river children see look carefully children are playing in the river some people are carrying water home what will they use it for now children look at the picture carefully in that picture some people are carrying water at home what will they use it for now see people who are carrying water at home they will use water for washing cooking drinking etc in many villages cows buffaloes and goats come to the river or pond to drink water grass and other bushes can be seen growing near the water hole animals bathe themselves in it birds like the lapwing kingfisher and egret can also be seen around the water source people from the village wash their clothes in it they carry water to use at home because people they do not have facilities like us so people from the villages washes their clothes in it and that water only they carry to use at home now what what's the solution now see children the water in the public sources has to be kept clean now we will see children how the public sources we can kept clean first we can follow some rules to kept public sources clean what are the rules that we can follow we will see do not throw garbage around you or around the river use a garbage bin do not wash clothes or vessels in the river never let the animals take bath in the river instruct people and put banners in a town keep the river clean explain people how we can kept clean water now page number 48 do you know people who keep animals provide drinking water to them without fail so children people who keep animals in their houses they provide food water to them we know that these animals too get thirsty but there are thousands of other animals we do not realize that they too need water because they all are living things ant honey bee scorpion and all other animal need water can you tell why do we go near a water hole in a jungle to see wild animal children when we go in a jungle 
we have seen that so many wild animals come near to the water hole to drink water children when wild animals get thirsty they come to drink water near a pond or lake different animals come to drink water there so people come to click photos of that animals wild animals also need water they come to the water hole in the forest when they are thirsty so people too go there in order to sight the wild animals now the importance of water people need water not only for drinking but also for cooking and cleaning we need water for agriculture and industry as well so children not only for drinking or cooking and cleaning but we need water for agriculture and industry water is very important in our lives without water all organism will die water is not only necessary but also our day to day life purpose we cannot imagine life without water so children we cannot imagine life without water now next page page number 50 try this take two potted plants of equal growth label them as 1 and 2 every morning for the next 5 days water only plant 1 do not water plant 2 now children you can see in the textbook that they have taken two potted plants of equal growth and they have label them also 1 and 2 now what to do you will water plant number 1 not plant number 2 what do you see plant number 2 which was not watered slowly dries up because children the plant number 2 do not get water so slowly it dries up and one looks fresh and green what does this tells us plants need water to live so children plants are also living things so they also need water to live plants need water we water our potted plants farmers water the crops in their fields could these plants live without water does we see that plants like animals need water so children plants and animals need water now use your brain power the trees in the forest also need water to grow from where do they get the water they need now next page page number 51 rain water sweep into the soil roots of plants spread deep into the soil these roots absorb the water that has spreaded into the soil now do you know some plants grows only in water we can try our best to grow them in soil so children some plants are there they grow only in water if we try them to grow in the soil but they cannot survive there the lotus water chestnut are also plants that grow in water so children you also know 
that the lotus grows in water now children what we have learned from this lesson we will see living things need water there is water in the bodies of living things that is why the body keeps working properly we get thirsty when there is a lack of water in our body many villages have a common source of water from which water is taken for use at home certain birds and plants are commonly found near such sources we need water not only for drinking but also for cleaning cooking growing crops and for industry too the roots of plants go deep into the soil and absorb water so children we have to always remember everyone should take care to keep the public sources of water clean it is each one's responsibility to do so so i think you understood the lesson now see today's homework today's homework already i have given you question answers fill in the blanks you have to learn this exercise and you have to write in your class work and homework notebook okay student goodbye have a nice day